Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru. It is August 16th, 2022. I am here for my Wordle of the Day and for Roller Coaster Day. I love roller coasters. This is one that almost killed my husband. It's called the Mind Eraser. Yes, his mind was gone after this. It was so much fun and my friends and I made him write it twice in a row. So I love roller coasters. And to me, it's not a true roller coaster. Well, I love roller coasters of all sorts, but the very best ones are the ones that have me going upside down over and over. All right. So we are going to use that as our inspiration for the day. And I'm going to use the word coast. I thought about using the word erase until I realized that it has two E's in it. So I can't pay homage to the mind eraser. What happened to my boxes on my whiteboard? Oh, they just disappear on me. Drives me crazy. Nope, they're gone. Oh no. Look what happens when I'm distracted. Nothing. This is not turning out to be like it turned out yesterday. All right, so what else can we do? Hmm, I'm seeing the word fried right away, and that reminds me of my husband's brain after we went on the mind eraser. So I'm going to go for that one. Okay, so we got two things. We have got an R, and we have got an E. We need a lot of stuff in between. What about cruel? No, we've already used the C. That does not work. So now I have a decision to make. Do I try to puzzle out to see what this word is going to be and try to get it on my third try, even though there could be 17 different options? Or do I just jump in with a whole bunch of letters You know, with this E, I saw cruel because I'm trying to think what could go in here and a U could go in there. And it could be gruel. We haven't tried the L yet. I would like to come up. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to come up with a word that has an L and an N and a G and if and a Y and if I can do that I think it's gonna be lungy if that works then I'm gonna go for it and if not I'm going to try coming up with the word I'm gonna try gruel so is lungy a word I don't know but I want to see if there's a U in there somewhere And I want to check the L and the N. What else could it be besides G? I could do lumpy, but then I'd have to get rid of the N. No, I'm going to try this. Nope, it's not on the word list. So I said I was going to try gruel. I'm really now regretting that quick decision. That is how you spell gruel, right? It never looks right to me when it's all in caps. I'm going to try it. I'm going to see. The worst that'll happen is we'll find out none of these other letters appear in here. And then that'll just shorten our list of things to try. Oh my goodness. Got it in three. That was, I didn't really expect it to be gruel. I just wanted it to be cruel. And I couldn't use the C. Okay, that was fun. Yeah, I liked that one. Not quite as fun as a roller coaster, but I still enjoyed myself. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to put those below. Remember to use the G more often than you think to, because it shows up all over the place. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.